Okay, we are shooting this video is to show you how to use our Oversee mobile application to configure the lock. Okay, this lock was is in default condition, which means I have to key in the master code at first. Okay, we use and want to key in the master code as one to six. Confirm again. Okay, we can also key in the uh, other codes like one four seven or two five eight as your master code. So I just set this lock, the master code as one to six. Okay, how to use this mobile app to configure? Okay, we need to use this test demo application, BTEC Smart Link. Okay, okay, you can check that there is already one lock on this application, and I want to add this lock on my application. Then I need to, okay, you need to tap this icon, and you can see here there is searching the nearby device okay meanwhile we need to uh, touch the panel to light up the lock to, to wake up the lock okay there is a one lock there is one lock ready pop up okay we need to enter the lock's password master password to verify to verify okay okay you can change the name or change the scene. Okay, next. Okay, device aided. Okay. So there is one more lock here, and this lock is referring to this H3. Okay. okay this page is the main page of the um, application. Okay. We can share Bluetooth key. We can uh, create code, fingerprints, and card. Okay. Let me show you how to um, add this card okay light up the panel okay key in master code okay click here okay and use the card to tap okay Just put a name. Okay, you can check there is a icon, a new icon to as the card. Okay, and I'm going to show you how to add a fingerprint. Use a fingerprint. Okay. Okay. Yeah, need to click OK and put a name. Okay, there is one more, one more fingerprint name inside. Okay, and we can also create a code. We can create user code or visitor code. Actually, user code is permanent code, and visitor code is temporary code. We can check. Enter a name first. Enter the password. And confirm the password. We need to choose valid valid time for this uh, temporary code. So I need to check. I want to set. Okay. okay, we can check that there is a visitor code here and end time is 11.45. Okay, the password is 369369. Okay, we can also share the mobile key. Okay. We can share permanent key, temporary key, a one-time key. Like I want to share it to. Okay. 
The key in the key name. Okay. So this is the mobile key we just added. Okay, let's check. Let's check if Okay, I just added a Temporary code. Okay, it's working now. Is eleven? Now is eleven forty-four. Okay, it's work. Okay, we can try on my fingerprint. And card. the okay. and my friend's phone on my friend's application we can check that there is a mobile one time key okay let's check okay light up the channel okay Okay, now it's 11.46. Let's check if the, if the uh, temporary code is still valid. Okay, the temporary code is 369.369. Okay, it's no more valid. So, okay. we can also have a uh, You can also have more advanced setting in this screen. Okay, it's inside here. Like safety mode, manual lock mode, or double lock, indication, and alarm setting, or delete the device. So that's, um, we can also see, we can also check the operating locks, like who just opened the lock, like this. Okay, so this is all about the uh, application.